All right. Uh, mm, so we, we okay. So we finished this. Oh, right, 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 right. We're working on this. What does this require? We need two computer ships and two titanium. I don't know if I need anything else. And I'm lazy, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna burn out our battery on this thing, and it'll be fine. Okay. Uh, we're gonna... I'm just gonna go silver hunting, I guess, for the time being. Wouldn't be a terrible idea if I actually grabbed the sea moth and brought it with me. For this. Because I think the, uh, I think the biters actually leave me alone. I know they have a name other than biter, but I just call them biters because... I mean... Let's be honest here. They look pretty bitey. How much... Okay, yeah, I've got plenty of space in my inventory. The only problem is I don't have a whole lot of oxygen here. Makes it a little bit harder, but it'll be okay. Now we just gotta find silver with without getting chomped. Oh, that's limestone. We don't want limestone. Well, let's see. This seems reasonable. There's some silver. Well, we already have enough. That's a good sign. I think there's some oxygen in here that I can grab, too. So as long as I stay pretty close to the the center of this, I think we'll be fine. Let's see, right? Yes. Okay, there are the weird, like, mind control -y things, which I have to worry about a little bit. Anyway, so as long as we can just hang out above these bubbles, we'll be good. Okay, yeah, Silver, the bane of all Subnautica players. Oh, crap. I seem to have picked up some kind of parasite. That hurt a little bit more than I thought it was going to. Ow. Okay. I didn't know those guys could do that. Oh, that sucked. And that screws up my oxygen. Okay, let's head for the surface, I guess. I wonder if I could... Hmm. Wow. That went high. Yeah, do we just grab the sea moth and do it? Yeah, let's let's grab the sea moth and do this. It's a lot easier, and I'm not entirely sure. I'm not entirely sure if it'll be a, a better idea or to have it like what would happen if I hopped in the sea moth with that thing on my arm? I have no idea. Well, it'll be fine. Okay, let's let's go back. Let's get a uh Oxygen thing. Switch on my batteries, because apparently I'm actually running low on those. And then we'll take the sea moth around. I really need to reorganize this base. It's awful. I have no idea. I have no idea how to plan this thing out, apparently. Okay. Uh, I guess we might as well... Oh. Did I... Okay, I did fill it up with melons. Um. Jeez. Might as well just plonk over some more seeds while we're here. Let's see, these growing beds are kind of awkward. Alright, whatever. And I'll probably just toss the last one in. In here, I guess. Oh, do you have do you have water for me? You do have water for me. Awesome! You're also incredibly flickery, which is really worrisome. Okay, looks like the bioreactor's going, so I'm just going to move this over. I'll just leave that for the time being. Yeah, what I'm probably going to do is get the uh, Cyclops and uh, get that going. Um, oh, wow. Big filtered water is actually uh, fits its name. Okay. Yeah, so what I'm probably going to do is get a Cyclops, turn that into a mobile base, and then eventually when I'm feeling a little bit more, um, I guess, brave... We'll try putting a, a base down in kind of a more interesting location than the, the places I currently am in. Okay, do I... Where did I put my extra oxygen? There's one. Keep it for that. I guess I'll move over the big filtered water for the time being. It'd be really nice if we could actually set, like, some kind of uh, resource distribution set up. Oh, right. We do want to get a power cell charger at some point. Uh, It's an interior thing. Interior modules. Here we go. No, that's a mod station. Fabricator. I don't recognize it based on sight. Here we go. Computer ship, wiring kit, glass, and titanium. Can I can I have it on this wall? Here. I'm going to put it here. Okay, so we need a computer ship and a wiring kit. 
So, wiring kit. Wow, we need a lot of silver. Huh. Okay. Yeah, how much silver am I... Was I carrying? I've got a couple. Oh, I've actually got like four silver hanging out in here. That actually makes this a little bit easier. Okay, uh, we need two gold. Let's see, anything else? Probably. We need table coral samples, so I'm gonna go get that first. Uh, there's some. Okay. Let's just grab what we want. Oh. I can scan these? Huh. I'm surprised I can't scan them when they're... Uh, on the wall. Okay. So now we've got that... You know, I'm gonna grab one more piece. Worst comes first, we just dump it. Kinda wish there was a trash action that I could actually just destroy something. Wait, question. Can I put table coral in the bioreactor to get rid of that? It'd be kinda nice if it was just a... a means of destroying. Okay, computer chip, wiring kit, glass, titanium. Okay, so we can get the wiring kit. What's the computer chip need? Quartz. Should have at least one piece. There we go. Yeah, I want to work on the vehicle modification thing, but getting a, a power cell uh, recharger first seems like generally the better idea. Okay, glass and titanium. Easy peasy. Unless we're out of titanium, at which point less easy peasy. <laughs> we might actually be out of titanium. We're out of titanium of all things. Well, isn't that a stinker? Alright, well we only need one more piece and we should be able to get some more while we're just out and about here. I guess we might as well grab this while we're here. Actually, come to think of it, if I just scan this, that's... That's some titanium. Man, I remember when I was... I'd, I'd say when I was obstinately... Just diving... Uh, without the sea glide. But then again, I didn't have uh, battery charging or anything like that, so I guess that was kind of moot. Or, not moot. But I guess it kind of makes sense to be conservative like that. Alright, do we have any more... On hand scrap material. Oh. Didn't realize this was, might actually be a viable place for silver as well. So what's this stuff? Oh, red table coral, just from the other side without the obvious red. Alright, anything else? There we are. How do you run out of titanium? I guess we probably burnt through a lot of it. Oh yeah, we burnt through a lot of it making ingots. I remember now. Inventory is full. How full? That full. Alright. Nope, that's not a that's not in anything. Okay. Oh, it's so nice having unlimited power. Originally I was just like, I don't really want to use this thing because I'm gonna be running out of uh I'm gonna be running out of batteries, and now it's just like Batteries are just kind of an inconvenience. Now, are there, like, uh, batteries that automatically recharge eventually, or... I don't know, whatever. I guess it doesn't matter too much. Okay. I gotta remember, our base is actually kind of limited on power here. Now, I guess it always was, I just never was fabricating enough resources that we needed to worry about it. Okay, anyway, uh... Alright, so we got the power cell charger. Where's my spare power cell? I threw it in one of these, I just totally don't remember which one. There we go. Looks like it would only charge just one power cell at a time, but that's fine. So we don't really use it that often. Okay, so if I remember right, I'm totally out of silver. No, I got one silver. I guess I'll move the lead and the copper o over. Okay, let's let's go check it take a look at the moon moon bay. And see what I needed for this sucker again. So two computer ships and two titanium. Well we got the titanium, no problem. But looks like we're gonna need at least one more silver, yes? Well, I guess I'm glad I got the extra table coral sample. We do need more. Okay, so I need to do that one more time. 
Okay, and I'll just transfer everything so we have some space. I'm just gonna take the uh, I'm just gonna take the the moth, the sea moth, uh, down with me, and we're just gonna do what we can. Oh. Got some spare melons. At some point, we'll have to worry about uh, protein in the diet, but right now, don't care. Uh, let's see. Might as well knife this one. There we go. Yeah, eat three, plant the last. Works great. I've also got spares, so we don't have to worry about it too much. Welcome aboard, oh. Captain. I want to get in my sea moth. I don't want to mess with the power cell. Dang it. Oh! Do I actually... I actually have to get in it via the... I have to get in it via the top now. That's mildly inconvenient. I guess we probably won't be... Uh, using the moon bay for a while then. Okay. Wow, there's some weird pop in. Well, I renamed the sea moth. Didn't realize you could do that. Actually. Let's see. So the deepest section is like kind of over here. Luckily, the the particularly bitey guys kind of leave. Leave me alone in the section I'd like to haunt. Just gotta find it again. Not to mention they can't actually do much damage to me. While I'm in this thing. Where is it? Is it like over here? Like it's through here. I guess we'll just bump him. Not that it really does a whole lot of damage. Okay. This seems like about the right spot. Right here is usually pretty good. Okay. Yeah, this is... This is the place. And we got some nice lighting, which is great. Okay. Yeah, so let's just try and grab as much silver as we can grab. I, I don't like coming back here. Not because it's like a serious impediment, it's just annoying. I don't like having to come back repeatedly for the same resources over and over and over again. Right. It's, uh... Hmm. You know, maybe I will take this thing around. Unfortunately, it looks like, uh, this stuff only spawns on the ceilings and whatnot. So anything on the ground is not even worth going after. Is this... Yeah, that's... That's sandstone. Of course, lost the silver. Be kind of a shame. Yeah, limestone. Limestone, sandstone, but glass. Hmm. Or not glass, gold. Really don't have much of a use for gold anymore. I probably do. Like, we use an amount of it. I've just collected so much over the, uh, the hours. We do have that egg there. I just don't have much to do with eggs right now. Okay. Looks like the mind control -y guys are... No, oh, that's limestone. Alright, well, let's hop... Back in the sea moth for a second, get our oxygen back, and figure things out. Yeah, we're gonna wanna. Oh right, we're gonna have to repair the sea moth before I go too far. Oh, that'll be a different day that we deal with. Uh, hmm. Surprisingly few resources now that I'm around here. Have I just like milked this place dry? I guess it makes sense. You can run out of resources here. Out. Didn't realize when we come down this deep. Alright, well. Oh, right, I was gonna grab a med pack. Whoopsie, totally forgot about that. Alright, whatever. Uh, hmm. Yeah, there you are, bitey bastard. Get out of here. Hmm. Seems like a good spot. He's just hanging out, which is a little bit limit limiting, and I don't want to... I need to get some kind of, like, pew-pew gun to make him go away. Because it seems like this is a pretty decent... Ah, that's where the bitey sucker is. Alright. Well, I'm probably going to call this bust, at least for the time being. There is too much, too much, uh, chow bot time. 
I kind of don't want to deal with it. Uh, maybe, maybe if we pop down here. How's this look? A little bit safer. He's he's pretty much on the other side. Hmm. So far, I'm not actually seeing any any deposits on either side. We might actually have to find a new area or reset the world again. Which actually wouldn't be that big of a deal. Well, one way or another, I've got the silver I need, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna get out of here. We'll we'll upgrade it later. Let's see. Shove the eggs into alien containment and it hatches. Uh, I don't have that at all, so we'll deal with it later. Ah. An aquarium, though. I guess I do have one of those. Alright, let's pop out. Might as well grab what scrap I can. Seeing as I can't fit anything else in. Okay, the green cyst on the aggressive fauna is the disease you're infected with. Oh! Interesting. Okay. I'm kind of surprised. Everybody keeps telling me that it should have popped up by now, but I actually haven't seen it. Uh, well, I can't take my gloves off, I guess, until we start getting rid of some of these things. At least the power's coming back. Get some more water. Let's see. Question is, is this Wanderer's first time playing Subnautica? I've... I've played... Well, this is not my first session for Subnautica, but this is my first playthrough. So, yes? I don't know. Okay. Oh. Do we have the space for this? Huh. Guess I did. Surprise. Apparently I cut it in half. Didn't realize I could get the extra. Okay. But yeah, no, I've, I've never played Subnautica before uh, this this playthrough. So I'm I'm pretty limited in what I know. Okay. Anyway, we want to get quartz. Surprised my inventory is not Oh, right, it's doing this weird bug again. Which is totally not a feature. Somebody was somebody was telling me it was an intended feature or something like that and it's like I don't I don't think so. Okay. So we got the two computer chips, and then the rest was just titanium, which I should have enough. Okay, cool. Let's see. Let's see how we can upgrade the sea moth. Though I guess I'm gonna have to bring the sea moth back up into the moon bay before I can do any upgrades. Okay, nothing docked. Uh, I guess let's grab the sea moth. Bring it in. Okay, this will be fine. I'm hoping we can get, uh, we can reinforce this thing so it goes deeper. I guess it's probably the, ah. That animation is always just a little bit jarring. Okay. Oh, wait, this just has, a, oh. Common modules, hull reinforcement. Hardens the chassis before collision. Okay. Pressure compensator. Hardens the vehicle chassis under medium pressures. Before collision... Okay, so eliminating damage under normal conditions. Extra power efficiency. Storage module. Then we can also get a solar channel. Charger. Perimeter defense system. Torpedoes. And a sonar. Sonar. Uh, and then we've got torpedoes. Okay, well... I guess I'm going to start with hull reinforcement. Maybe? We're going to want a plasteel ingot and a ship. Oh, hey! Okay. Uh, I didn't realize I could customize this, so this is the base color. Let's, let's make this a nice wanderbot orange stripe uh, I'm gonna up the saturation wow that's actually pretty close to perfect secondary stripe is going to be like here maybe a little bit more on the blue there we go interior uh, oh
There we go. Maybe a little bit more this way and this way. Uh, and then we have stripes. Oh, crap. Uh, it actually was perfect where it was for the most part. Might drop the... There we go. Okay, so now we've got the land mammal. Oh, yeah. You look good. Uh, let's see. What do we want to do? So we've got... I guess we should probably eat a bit. We want to make some more uh, health kits. Let's just eat two of these. That will be good. I don't think we need any more seeds immediately. Uh, oh, right. I was going to figure out how to actually upgrade this thing. Okay. So somebody was telling me... Oh! Oh, it's these. Access upgrades. Okay, so we got four, four, four upgrades total that we can put in this thing. So I guess we're starting with that. <laughs> wow, that is terrible text. Like, text to just have on the side. Okay, so I can fit four of these total. Uh, what can we do? So, solar charger, it's kind of useful. Mostly, I want storage. So, titanium. And we got to figure out how to make plasteel. So, I guess, plasteel and titanium. Uh, three titanium. Welcome aboard, Captain. Oh, you can access the upgrade module at any time. Oh, that's actually kind of good to know. I think for the time being, I'm not going to mess with it too much. I don't think we really need, uh... Too much. Uh, let's see. Advanced. That's uranium. Plasteel ingot. Titanium and lithium. Oh. Oh, wait, no. That's a titanium ingot. Oh. I don't think I have the resources for that. We might have to go get some more. Oh. Old cooked bladder fish. Shoot. I was going to eat that. All right, whatever. I got a ton of lithium. It's just the titanium ingots that that are going to be a bit on the pricey side. I guess I should start grabbing those. You mean the terrible text I have on the side? Uh, the the text for the for naming your ship. Uh, it says land mammal, but it's this like really low res bad font. I, I ugh. It just doesn't look nice. Because comparatively, okay, I can get at least two more pieces of scrap metal in here. So we're going to need titanium for days. And I think I might actually pop out and reset the world uh, before I go too far. Uh, just because, I don't know if you guys noticed, but we're having some like crazy visual tearing as it's like trying to resolve the... Uh, as it's trying to resolve how the, uh, the terrain goes. Which is awkward, and I don't like it. Okay, uh, entrance is over here. Okay. And we got plenty of power. Okay, cool. I don't have to worry about too much. Okay, so we can make, we should be able to make Plasteel now? Yeah! And then I should have enough titanium that I can also make a storage thing. We don't need storage that badly, but that way I can carry around stuff like uh, spare oxygen tanks. And I won't have to worry too hard about um, running out of personal inventory space. Gives me a little bit more flexibility. I wonder if I could actually get some more. Let's see, when do I plan on making my base more efficient? Later. Right now, this is, this is going to be what it is, just because mostly lazy. Uh, oh, right, I need a computer chip. Well, at the very least, I can get the storage container. I wonder if I could actually put in multiple storage containers. Oh, other side. Okay. But yeah, I'll, I'll be messing with my base either today or tomorrow. Probably, probably the next time. Alright, so how do we access the locker? Does it show up on the other side? It does. Okay, so this way we can move stuff over. So I guess I'm going to move over the oxygen tanks. I could also move over the sea glide, come to think of it. Okay. Somebody's demanding that I get the plan for the ion battery. Oh, jeez, yeah. Okay, this is... Uh, this is dumb. Yeah, I... Let's turn off ambient particles, bloom, and light shafts. That should help. 
I'm going to be totally honest. I don't know where the plans for anything are. Oh, wow. Yeah, this this performs way better now that we've cranked those off. Uh, I don't know where the plans are for anything. So, like, you can demand all you want, but I don't, I don't know where I'm going to find it. Okay. So, let's see. Uh, we needed... Ah, right, a computer chip. Did I, did I put away my silver? I did. I put it away over here. So we just need another computer chip. Which means I need one more table. I hope it was a computer chip. It's gonna be pretty sad when it turns out it wasn't. Okay, and looks like we've got the quartz handy. That's good. This should actually also solve the pop-in issue. It does kind of take away some of the majesty of the light shafts, but I will take that over per performance. Okay. Anyway, uh, please tell me it was a computer chip. I'm going to be pretty sad if it wasn't, but I guess we can always go back. Okay. That was everything, right? Just plasteel and a computer chip? I think it was. Okay. Anyway, uh, yep, here we go. Pressure compensator. So, does this mean I can go all the way, uh, as deep as possible, or no? I guess it doesn't matter that much. Let's see, what else do we have? Torpedo system, perimeter defense system. I don't even know how to make that. I guess for the time being, this will be fine. We'll have three upgrades in here, and I'll either figure out if I need a weapon or uh, something else. Okay, crush depth is now 300 meters, so I can go... A fair bit deeper, though not nearly as deep as I'd like. Well, that's okay. Uh, let's see, what do we want to do? I guess power. And then I'm going to go back to... Um, I guess I'm going to go back to... Six? No, no. We want to go back to number four. Uh, Life pod four. That's where we found the uh, Cyclops parts. I just don't know if there's any more. Okay. Oh, if you want to go... Deeper, it's, uh, I need more than one. Oh, shoot, we actually had a spare computer chip in there. Uh, could I make another? Because I could actually store one of those, now that I'm thinking about it. All right, where's all that spare lithium I'm carrying around? There it is. Okay, let's see if I can stack two. Because if I can stack two, we can get the other stuff. But yeah, I want the, uh, I want the, the stuff for the Cyclops. And I think I know where to get it. Okay. Upgrade station can upgrade the pressure compensator to Mark Three For even deeper. Oh. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what else we can mess with. So is, is this the... This is the upgrade station, yes? No, this is the vehicle modification system. Do we have the upgrade system? That's vehicle modification. Or is it is it the same thing and I just need the uh I probably just need the recipe for it. Okay. Well, all right. I'm just going to go with what I got cuz yeah, prawn thermal jump jet Interesting. And torpedo arm. Well, those are mostly useless to us for the time being. Vortex torpedo and gas torpedo. Yeah, mostly not useful. Let's see if I can get a second uh, one of these in, probably. What else could we do? Could do torpedoes if we want to. Wait. I have the recipe for it? For the modification system, or...? I am confused. Or are we talking the recipe for the C uh for the Cyclops? Okay, it's the it's a modification station. Okay. Yeah, so we already have this. Unfortunately I can't do anything more than what I've got, so I can't make a Mark III pressure thing for a while. Okay, well that's fine. Yeah, so I'm just gonna make another pressure compensator and that should be fine, I think. I don't know. The problem. The problem is, 
as usual with this game and other games, I'm, I'm re relying slightly on information from other people. Oh! Oh! Modification station. We do have it. I just need to make a wiring kit, which means more silver. 